if you have left your job and unemployed for more than two months if your total service period is more than six months but less than 10 years then you are eligible to withdraw full pf and pension amount from your pf account and you can easily apply for this online today in this video i'm going to tell you the latest process of pf withdrawal online but before that if you have not subscribed my channel then I would request you to please subscribe my channel for more PF related updates. To apply for full PF withdrawal online, first you have to open EPFO website. Search EPFO in Google. On the top of the search results, you will see EPFO website link. Click on that link to open EPFO website. On the website, in the right hand, you will see some options. Click on online claims member account transfer. Once you click the option, you will see a login screen. Here login with your PF account login details. Enter your universal account number, your password, CAPTCHA code and then click on login button. After login to your PF account, the dashboard will look like this. Before applying full PF withdrawal, KYC updation is mandatory in your PF account. Your Aadhaar, your bank account details, your PAN details should be updated. Your date of exit updation is also mandatory. Before applying your full PF withdrawal, one more thing is important that if you have worked more than one company, then you should transfer your old PF account to your current account first so that old plus new companies PF plus pension amount can be withdrawn. If these details are updated in your PF account, to apply for full PF withdrawal, go to online services and select claim. On the next page, enter your bank account number to verify. Click on verify button. After that, to confirm their certificate of undertaking by clicking on yes. Then scroll down and click on proceed to online claim. On the next page below in I want to apply, select your claim form. Here first you have to select form 19 for PF withdrawal, then form 10C for pension withdrawal. So first I am selecting form 19 here. After that upload form 15G if applicable. Form 15G is applicable when your PF withdrawal amount is more than 50,000 and your total service period is less than 5 years. Then to save TDS amount, Form 15G is uploaded. After that, enter your complete address according to your Aadhaar card. Then below upload your cancel check copy or passbook copy of the bank you updated in your KYC. Remember the copy should be clear and your bank account details should be clearly visible. Like your name, bank account number, IFSC code all should be clear. After that, below accept their disclaimer by clicking on checkbox. Once you accept the disclaimer, you will see a button below, Get Aadhaar OTP. Click on Get Aadhaar OTP button to get the OTP on your registered mobile number with your Aadhaar card. Enter the OTP you received below. Click on Validate OTP and Submit Claim Form. Once you click on that, your PF withdrawal claim form is successfully submitted. After that, to apply for pension withdrawal, Again click on online services and again select claim. On the next page again enter your account number, click on verify, again accept their undertaking and click on yes. Scroll down and click on proceed to online claim. On the next page in I want to apply, this time you have to select only pension withdrawal claim form 10C here. Again enter your complete address according to your Aadhaar card. Upload cancel check copy or fastbook copy here and accept the disclaimer below again. Again click on get Aadhaar OTP button to get the OTP on your Aadhaar registered mobile number. Enter the OTP and again click on validate OTP and submit claim form. Once you click on the button, you will see your pension withdrawal claim is also submitted successfully. After applying PF plus pension withdrawal claim online by submitting form 19 and 10C, it takes around 7 working days to transfer the PF plus pension fund to your bank account. If you want to know the status of withdrawal claims, go to online services and click on track claim status. Here you can see the status of your all the claims you have applied before. So guys, if you liked the video, please share this video to your friends and subscribe my channel for more videos like this. Thanks for now, all the best.